If you are new to incubating eggs, hopefully this third short clip of six about our mini advanced incubator will give you the information you need about the digital display menu. So let's start by plugging the machine in. As you can hear, it will sound a buzzer and will start warming up. The asterisk on the digital display tells you that it is warming up. When it approaches the correct temperature, which is 37 and a half degrees centigrade for hen eggs, that asterisk will start to slowly flash. You'll also notice a little flashing P symbol. This appears when the machine is first switched on, but its real function is to appear as a warning if the power has been interrupted during incubation due to a power cut. To clear it, simply press the OK button down for two or more seconds. There we are, that's gone. So you're then left with T for temperature and the current temperature reading. There's the T and the current temperature reading, which is at 30.9 and moving upwards. Below that, you have the day menu, which tells you how many days remain until hatch. So it's telling us at the moment there are 40 days until hatch. If we're about to start incubating hen eggs, we would normally want it to read 21 days. But for ducks, for example, you would normally set it to 28 days. And in the next clip, I'll show you how we adjust this. Finally, we have a little turning symbol here. That little symbol indicates that the machine is set automatically with the turning on. So it turns the eggs by rotating the egg disc. We always recommend that you allow the incubator to run for at least an hour before making adjustments or placing eggs in it. That gives the machine a chance to stabilise at the correct temperature and to enable you to be confident about the environment. Our next clip looks at how you access the menu once the machine has stabilised so that you can make some adjustments or simply confirm the factory settings.